The MT-12 Rapra was a Soviet-towed anti-tank gun. It is an improved version of the T-12 anti-tank gun. This anti-tank gun was developed during the late 1960. In 1970 it replaced in production the T-12. It was produced in the city of Yurga. During the Cold War this gun has been exported to a number of Soviet allies, including East Germany. Despite its age this anti-tank gun is still used in Russia and some countries. Most of them are former Soviet republics. Ukraine is currently one of the largest operator of this gun with around 500 units in service and in storage. The MT-12 is deployed by mechanized and motorized infantry units. These anti-tank guns are used to protect the flanks against hostile counterattacks during rapid advances. The MT-12 Rapra follows the lines of the previous T-12 anti-tank gun. It has a new 2A29 100mm smoothbore gun, improved gun carriage and gun shield. It used the same ammunition as the T-12. This gun is normally equipped with 20 rounds of ammunition. This includes 10 armor-piercing fin-stabilized, discarding sabo, APFSDS, rounds to engage tanks and heavily armored targets, 6 high-explosive anti-tank, heat, rounds to engage lightly armored and soft-skinned vehicles, and 4 high-explosive fragmentation, HFRAG, rounds to engage hostile troops, buildings, and various area targets. The APFSDS round has a maximum range of 3 kilometers. The heat round has a maximum range of 5.95 kilometers. The HEFRAG round has a maximum range of 8.2 kilometers. In most cases, this gun is used on ranges of up to 3 kilometers, as visibility on the battlefield is often limited. This anti tank gun is normally used as defensive weapon. It is camouflaged and fires from an ambush. This 100 gun is no longer effective against modern main battle tanks. It cannot penetrate front armor of modern main battle tanks, unless at very close ranges. However it is still useful against other armored vehicles. Though in most cases this gun is used on much shorter ranges, as visibility on the battlefield does not allow to exploit such ranges. Normally this anti-tank gun is used as defensive weapon and fires from ambush. This anti-tank gun has a crew of 6 or 7. It includes commander, gunner, loader, two ammunition crewmen and driver of the towing vehicle. It is normally towed by an MTLB tracked armored vehicle. Alternatively, the MT-12 can be towed by Ural 6x6 military truck or other vehicles. The towing vehicle carries the crew and 20 rounds of ammunition for the gun. For short distances this gun can be moved by its crew. Emplacement time is only 60 seconds. When traveling over snow or marshlands the gun carriage can be equipped with LO7 ski kit. Planned replacement of the MT-12 Rapra was a 2A45 Sprut A and 2A45M Sprut B 125mm anti-tank guns. The last mentioned had a small engine for self-propulsion and self-emplacement. These guns use the same 125mm ammunition as the T-64, T-72, T-80 and T-90 main battle tanks. Both guns were designed in the late 1980s. Future of the 2A45 Sprut A is unclear, but production of the 2A45M Sprut B commenced in 1989. However this anti-tank gun never fully replaced the MT-12. The MT-12 is still in service, even thought it is no longer effective against modern main battle tanks.